Okay, this how-to video is going to show you how to use your library models and actually associate the step the step file directly with the library model. So you can see I can physically open the DRA file the same way I would normally file open, change it to package symbol and actually open the DRA file. Um, and then I've got the same option, so set up step package mapping to actually create the mapping file. There's the 3D view of my place bound shape. I can then go and pick the part that I need. So let's just go and find SM, SMB, SMB right angled. Now obviously if, the, if you're not getting step models in this directory here, you can actually go and make sure that the step path is, is set, uh, it's under setup user preferences. And you can see the rotation of the model has obviously been modeled in different X, Y, Z locations to the part that I have here. So I need to rotate this part in the X and then also in the Z. That will then give me the correct orientation. It's just a matter of locating the, the height of the part. So let's go and set up the, the height of the part. Now these can you can just try this with trial and error, you know, and actually see the part physically mapping through the board, get to know the actual value that you know to get this so it's actually seated correctly on the board. And when you're using surface mount parts, maybe you need to account for solder as part of the, the height of the device. So you can actually allow for that when you're actually setting your Z direction. It's quite a useful feature. I can still overlay these and actually have a look at these and and try and make sure I've got the orientation correct just by looking at the, the, the different views that we have here. Once I'm happy with that, I then save that. And then that's now part stored as part of the model. So if I was to look at the, uh, the edit properties for this part and maybe just did a drawing select, you'll see that I've now got effectively the step package. So there's the step package. There's the locations and the rotations and the angles and stuff that I need when I go forward into using the tools in 